Game's a little. <clears throat> ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. <clears throat> um, and what's funny is the game runs fine for me. So, I'm not sure. He's full health again. There's just too many of them. By the time we get through it, mm. um, but yeah, so basically what I found out is because they were in a smaller ship, my guns couldn't track and kill them. I was like, what? Yeah, I needed some grenades. And I didn't Grab any beforehand. Unfortunately. And I don't think we got the DPS to, to throw this thing down. Even with me firing, we're just not doing enough damage by time. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh, yeah. All right, moving them back. Like, let's say here. I was planning on trying to kill the whole nest right now because the pollution's getting to them, so. Yeah, yeah, I'm same here. Uh, simply, let's go tree. Yeah, it's the same. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Yeah. So that's what I'm trying to do is kill the worms. So that's, yeah. I'm, I'm with you on, uh, uh, we got the same strategy. The problem is, one, I'm running out of bullets at this point. Jeez. And uh, I can't get this guy down. <sighs> All right. I don't have nearly enough bullets now to... Uh... All right, we're going to tactically retreat. It's not going to be good because they're going to start unloading on us. Yes. Yeah, they're, they're, man, they're, they're rough. All right. No, they're just sending normal. I don't see any double. Yes, but we do try to keep the swearing down a little bit. Yeah. Why am I using a pistol again? Um, only because we do have some uh, <laughs> some teenagers that join the the chat. Um, so we try to keep it as kid friendly as we can. <sighs> grenade. Yeah. Maybe grenades. Maybe you're right. Maybe grenades is the answer. Cause that hurt and sucked. All right. <clears throat> At least I know I need to get some more coal down the line. Okay. Cause for some reason I decided to run like all my stuff with one belt line. Oh, the bot's gone crazy anyways. That thing lost the cuckoo's nest a long time ago. All right, let's grab some grenades real quick. Yes. <clears throat> well, I love this skill. I love the fact that the skills, it was actually time-based, not, you know, like, 
how many hours you could put into the game. So you could queue up skills if, if you know, especially if you knew that you weren't going to be there. Um, you could queue up some skills so you didn't lag behind. Oh, it definitely has those principles. Like, you're not wrong. Not wrong there. Oh, yeah, grenades got to go on the belts. I've actually never used grenades in this game. Okay. Let me grab some... Some belts. We got to fix some coal up there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, and Eve got got real toxic there for a while. Um, I got real, I got real toxic. The community got real toxic. Which you know happens sometimes, but yeah, it was. Not great. Okay. Oh, man. Well, and at this point, you know, the people that have, that have been playing from, like, the start have such a huge advantage or anybody that's coming in for the first time that you're, you're literally never going to catch them. You just they're they're gonna have such a massive advantage over you that it's 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 not worth it. Okay, that's my steel line. I don't know why I decided to run like four different things off of this line, but And I don't think two extra smelters are going to be the answer to it, but can't hurt. We need more coal. Okay. Well, we need to get out of here. At this point, we need to get out of here. <laughs> well, I, that's, I am very much a gamer that The bot catches everything. So Nightbot is... Oh, no. Uh, the bot didn't catch anything there, uh, Morin. Um, so Wacog put in... So we do a thing <clears throat> on this... Uh-oh. That's what I was starting to get afraid of. Um, so if you... he We do a thing on the, um, on the channel where uh, we put people's names in. So you put your exclamation point in the name, and the Nightbot basically gives a saying that Sun Wakog has put together. And so that's what you're seeing right there. Alright, I need to... We're going to manually load this for right now, and then... I'm not going to forget to put this on this time. Because I tend to forget. Okay. This is my... F no, I've played Factorio before, but this is my first time in a long time. Um, and there's some, there's some differences from the last time I played. Then again, I'm not used to dying this much, but... That'll teach me for attacking... Poking the hornet's nest. Although we're gonna have to deal with that. It's still it's still a fantastic game. I'm I'm enjoying it thoroughly. Um, if I can get my butt. Uh, man, biters on peaceful is not a bad way to play. Oh, yeah. 
C block. Never heard of it. Is there a sort function? I don't know. Yeah. Well, in interesting. Well, uh, Zim Colo play is playing one. Um, <clears throat> that's like a freighter one that adds. Um, C lanes to the game. What was I looking to grab? Oh. Duh. Alright, I gotta get I gotta get re back organized because Jeez. Yeah, well, you know, so when I when I play, like, we could be a lot farther along. Obviously, I'm not researching anything right now, and um, I tend to take my time. Let's say oh, I should have put a splitter right there, but eh, that's good. Um, because we could finish this pretty quickly. You know what I mean? Well, you know what, though? But it, I find that if you, if, for me personally, if I'm playing a game like this, I want to take my time. You know what I mean? I want to enjoy the game to the fullest. I don't want to rush through it. Same thing when we play, uh, like, Final Fantasy VII. You know, I try to get all the... Oh, jeez. That's, that's a lot. But hey, as long as you're still having fun, that's literally all that's important. Exactly. Exactly. Well, and I think, and I think that's true for all games, personally. Like, if you pay the money, play the game. Okay, that's a lot. That's a lot. I think I have two thousand or 200, two hundred, almost three hundred hours in this game. But again, it's from you know a long time ago. Things are definitely different. To all that are listening, the next community game is going to be Prop Hunt on Black Ops Cold War. Hope to see you guys on there for that. Yeah, yeah. Well, and I like communities like that where it's nice and chill and... Well, this right now is is <clears throat> I need to get to where I'm I'm where. <sighs> so we're I'm doing the railroad scenario. Um. So things are far away. So this is still my starting resources, and so I need to get to a point where I'm no longer, where I've, I've got my railroad track set up, and then it'll be. Yeah, rail worlds. Yeah, and it's I'm I mean I love it. It's it's. It's been great so far. Jeez. You know, I watched, um, so I have a buddy who plays this, is a lot better than I am. Um, he's actually, he's a follower on the channel. Um, he's crazy, crazy good. Um, and, uh, I think he has something like he's got to have thousands of hours into the game that he's currently, but his map is so big that you can't like, I can't physically join his game anymore. His, his world is pushing out too much. Um, What you call it? Um, 
Yeah, his base is gargantuan. <laughs> and I fully endorse a good mega base. I'm I'm a I'm a fan. Um but his is so big that you he can't have anybody join the server. That's when it gets a little bit on the yeah, this is not enough. Okay. Okay, we're going to borrow. Yeah, borrow that coal. Okay. That's crazy. That's craziness. But you know what? Those those bases are fun. Though you know, <laughs> it's fun to imagine those things and get them to work. And um, yeah, yeah, it's. <clears throat> it's a lot of fun. And I gotta fix this. For some reason I decided to go down the middle here for a dumb reason. Okay, so we need trains. Lane 14. Right there. I mean, it depends on what settings you're using. You know what I mean? I would say that that... That that's probably true. Oh, I need, um, although I've seen some vanilla games, or how, I mean, it's based, you know, for me, thank you very, very much, I very, very much appreciate it, and, uh, yeah, I will do my best to take the very best care of them. Um, and then everybody make sure you go over and, uh, click a follow. Okay. Hopefully that did it for me. So we'll go ahead and, and anybody that we get in today, we'll have, hopefully pop over and give you a follow at least. So I really do appreciate it. <laughs> Look at this guy showing off. He has a girlfriend. <laughs> Later. <laughs> okay. Train is coming up. Because I put it right there and then I ran away. Duh. Also, I didn't bring my lights. Alright. <clears throat> it's still the first hour of the day. So I'm still waking up. I haven't even gotten a full cup of coffee. Uh, so. I'll stop making the simple mistakes and move on to, you know, bigger mistakes here in a little bit. I'm looking right at it, too. Okay. Let's get it together. Uh, it's... It's it's my OCD. Um, I like. Ooh. Um. It just it gives me a way to visually know what I got going on. Okay, so that worked. Oh, don't worry. Uh, we, I, a good friend of mine, uh, Jeremy, who's in here, um, builds the same way you build. Yeah, I have gotten used to it over the years. So, <clears throat> if I need to, I'll play. Um, that's what I thought. 
Okay. Um, it's steel, right? Okay. But, yeah. It doesn't bother me too much. I'd be lying if I said it bothered, didn't bother me at all, but it doesn't bother me too Oh, jeez. Um, yeah. <laughs> well, and it's, <clears throat> you know, both ways have merit, you know. Um, whether you're building um, very logistically like this or if you're building organically. And, uh, you know, a lot of times I wish I could build organically. Because organically is going to get you, is going to allow you to build things faster. Like, you're going to... Medulla oblongata, Worcestershire, anti-disestablishmentarianism, otorhinolaryngologist, anthropomorphism. What? Um, there are a lot of times I wish I could, um build more organically. Um, it would make my life a lot easier. That works. Uh, we're gonna need, yeah. What are you missing? Oh, you just, okay. So we're just gonna let that do its thing. Do I not have? Okay, cargo wire. Okay, no. Pipe to ground. Okay. Right here, we've got the cargo wagon. Yeah, I figured you're going to be upset. So let's just, let's do the changeover now. Really, you're just you're just not gonna give me an inch, huh? You. Uh, we want. I should know it's iron gear. Everything is iron gear. You're gonna need steel, right? Yeah, steel and iron. Okay. Uh, and so just so everybody knows, anybody that's new. Uh, we do take a break at the top of each hour. Yeah, you're going to need another longer arm here. Okay. Um, <clears throat> sorry, was, uh, was thinking in my head and now I lost my thought. Uh, which happens to me sometimes. Um, so, yeah. So, we take a break at the top of each hour. Um, just a five minutes so people can get up, use the bathroom, and grab something to drink. Uh, it's also when I run the ads. Um, and that way, you know, people that aren't subscribed um, don't really miss anything. You know what I mean? Um, okay, good. And, uh, yeah. What are you missing? 13 engines? Okay, well. How many engines do you need? You need 20 engines, good talk, good talk, okay. Okay. Well, that'll give us time to get, <coughs> oh, we need to get the next level technology. All right, there's no more, no more left there. And I want to get the train stops. Uh, and then probably rail signals. Because those are going to be important. Although technically we don't have a way out of our base right now. 
um, which is going to make things more fun. Um, I have to do it over here. So we'll come down and then reconnect and go up through here. So basically what's going to happen is like, let's say we're going through here, right? We're going to build our station to collect all the ore that we're going to be picking up. And it's basically going to come down, you know, down here through this top rail. And if it's iron, it's going to go up here and stop here, unload, and then continue on its journey up and around that's going to be kind of the tentative um, tentative loop And then the rail signals are all going here. Can you get there from here? No, okay. I gotta put it here. Alright, we got one here. Is it one and one? Yeah, okay. And then we're going to do this. But let's go ahead and take those breaks now. And uh, again, just a five minute, get up, use the bathroom, grab something, drink, do what you got to do. Yeah. Well, there's going to be two rails in there, but one for the... the so this is going to get mirrored. One for the north side, one for the south side. <clears throat> so, yeah, it'll, it'll go through instead of trying to do a turnaround. But we'll look at that when we get back. All right, guys. Five minutes. 